number it as 1, 2, 3, 4. Okay? Now, once you number like that, from moving from right, going to left, you should also do the same, moving from left, going to right. So this is going to be 1, 2, 3, Okay, so now you compare which of those numbers, the top numbering and then also the down numbering. So the one which gives you the shortest number, okay, the shortest number of the carbon position at which the double bond is occurring, that is the correct number because that is what we want. So when I count from the top number in one, two, three, so the carbon is, the double bond is occurring at carbon number three, or position number three. What about the other way around? Okay, so one, okay, one. So at this carbon, going from left to right, one, okay, you have the double bond. So the numbering on top is actually incorrect, okay, it's actually incorrect. While the numbering at the bottom is correct. So we are going to follow the bottom number so that you can also identify this ethyl group at what position of the carbon is it branching off from the normal hydrocarbon. So if I follow this one, so one, two, three. So at carbon number three, this is where the branching off is taking place. So the name So the name is going to be, you start with this, um, this one, the ethyl group. So you say carbon number three. So the three means that this ethyl group is taking place or is branching off from the normal hydrocarbon at carbon number three. So three ethyl dash. Okay. Three ethyl dash. And then you come to this part where the double bond is occurring. So at carbon number one, dash, and then you count now the number of carbon in the unbranched of carbon, I have unbranched of hydrocarbon. So one, two, three, four. So the hydrocarbon with uh, four carbon is called butane, okay? Now that gives us the question, or that, that gives us uh, the name of this structural isomer in our kings. So, ladies and gentlemen, if you have more challenge, please you can also drop your comment. You can also, um, you know, uh, comment. Uh, you ask question in the comment section so that we can also follow up and just try to help you 